Hey everyone, this video is about how to create old film effect in After Effects without any plugin. So this is my clip part you're seeing right now and I have downloaded this from pixels.com and you can find the link in description. So let's get started. Uh, select your clip and go to effects and presets and type hue and saturation and drop it and make saturation tool zero now type here noise and apply noise and uncheck color now leave around seven or eight now let's create the vignette so we can use mask so click twice on this ellipse and now press F for feather I'll leave it this much now let's get a new layer so press command Y on your Mac or control Y on your PC I'll type here factor noise brightness or just or increase the contrast now let's animate this so go to evolution and the last frame I'll make it around 20 our animation now this let's rename this to dust and go to mode and make it green so that we can see our white dust and this is fine and now let's get the scratches so make copy of this Press Command D or Control D on your PC, and you'll rename it again to Scratches, and go to Transform and uncheck this uniform scaling, and we'll scale it in height. So go to Height, and you can make it more. This is right now 100, and make it 600. So you can see what we have done right now we scaled it in height and width make it very less because right now this is this is a, a blobby one will make it very thin so make it around one so here I have the scratches so make it slightly better I'll go to this scale thing and make it 1200 select all of them command here control a and press control shift c for pre-composite press ok now you will just uh, give a look of handed camera so camera shake on this footage select your footage and press p for position and add one keyframe at the beginning and other one at the end now select both the clip now you need to animate x and y values which we will do with the wiggler so make sure you have selected your keyframes and go to wiggler if you don't find it here you can bring it from window you will find wiggler here there so now leave this setting or you can just make sure apply to this special path not uh, temporal graph and to noise type to smooth and dimension to all independent and frequency I'll make it to 40 and I will leave it to 3 and let's apply now I can see I have lots of keyframe here let's play
we can see the animation here and what is happening i'll show you just make sure checkerboard is on and now you can see the moment how much it is happening here you can see x and y i'll leave it to this much and let's scale to fit this so press s on your keyboard and scale it around 100 and make sure to switch on the motion blur you can see the difference now let's add the light flicker so go to fx and presets and type your levels And we will do a manual keyframing here so click on this stopwatch and zoom in here a bit so we can do frame by frame animation here and make a let's go to next frame and finally next so this is our light flicker press u and just copy these Control c command c on your mac and paste it now again copy all of them Control c or command c on your mac and paste it let's zoom out and let's make one more time copy paste and now select all of them and press alt or option your mac and just stretch till end keyframe till last keyframe press alt and drag it and we are done let's make a preview so if you have any queries please leave in comment i'll reply and hope you find it useful thank you so much for watching see you in the next video